Okay. Hey, oh, good. Whoa. I hope that light ain't too much. That's all I got going on right now. So I have my breakfast, y'all. I have my, uh, with some grits, shrimp and grits and eggs. And now I am um, finishing up my, what is that, rice, red, mushroom coffee. Cause I got to oof. It's getting there, though. Getting sexy big. Uh, uh, don't look at me. If I say I'm getting sexy back, I'm bringing sexy back. Don't look at me. Roll your eyes, too. I roll my eyes, too. My dog, she hating. Yeah, I forgot my thing this morning, y'all. I do got my knee braces on, though. I just threw something on just to have on some clothes because I ain't going nowhere. But I went to the doctor yesterday about this daggone knee. And, what can I do? No. No, I'm just going to leave it like it was. And, um, I was sad. I got to get another MRI stat. And then we went from there. They basically saying they don't know what else to do for me. Well, you broke it. Shit. So anyway, after I left there, I went to, um, where did I go? Oh, I went and ate. Of course, I went and snoozed it up. Got me some snooze, y'all. And then I went to TJ Maxx and Marshall's and found a couple things. Not what I was looking for, but still found some stuff. So I'm just showing y'all my little quick TJ Maxx Ross haul. Real quick. <laughs> Stuff falling as you can hear. What I get? So this is Marshalls. I found I found some tea, some peppermint. I just always be buying a little corny stuff. So I found some peppermint tea. And some salt and pepper pistachios. Y'all know how it is. You take a risk with the Ross and, and the TJ Maxx snacks. <laughs> Marshall snacks. And it's this one. A dandy liver detox. Whatever. Just some tea. And then I found... What else I get? Uh, oh, 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 this is heavy. Then I found... Oh, I got some just some essential oils. I don't know if these ones work at all. I just get them just to see. Because they're the already mixed kind. So this is the... Positive energy, unwind, and breathe deep. So I got those. I got two of those because I got one for somebody else too. One of my friends, him got bad asthma, y'all. And ain't nothing working. So I was like, have you tried essential oils? And he was like, for what? <laughs> and not that kind of friend. He really just a friend. But anyway, he was like, for what? I was like, so you can breathe. <laughs> so anyway he ain't know nothing about humidifier diffusers and stuff so i got i'll show you what i got i got so i got him a pack of those the breathing kind because it's already mixed with the eucalyptus mint and stuff so anywho that's why i got two of those so then i found me some little ceramic bacon pans because i don't know if y'all know like i told you i love using oh. okay my little bone i hurt <laughs> it's not okay anyway so I love using my little toaster oven, right? And but I keep like using these like recycled aluminum pan. I probably shouldn't be using them. So I finally found me some cute little baking dishes to go inside of my toaster oven. They were ten dollars a piece. I got two. I got white. They had blue, but they didn't have blue in this size to match my kitchen. I was like, no, you not. So these are good. They are dishwasher safe, oven safe, boiler safe, microwave safe, food safe. <laughs> Um, and, but I can't like put them on no direct heat. So it says like, I can't put them on like my gas stove and stuff like that. So anyway, this is the one I got, I got two of these because I'm starting to upgrade my cookware. So yeah, new beginnings. As soon as the horse is over, <laughs> new beginnings. Well, I mean, it's a new beginning. Uh oh. My TV went off. Oh shoot! Oh, uh, what I done? What I done did? 
Well, I don't want the TV doing. Um, oh, it's the thing where you can do your artwork, make backgrounds, and you can turn the TV into the picture frame. Yeah, I can't do that because my TV not hanging on the wall. Well, how the hell I get out of there? Go back to where I was at. I was I was supporting folks on YouTube, letting their stuff play. I be finding people only got a little bit of views, y'all, and then I just let it play. So that's what I'm doing right now. Anyway, so back to what I was saying. Got to be another one. Got two of these for the $10 a piece. Move these because they're a little heavy for my little table. Right and then what else I get from the Marshalls? Did I get those from the... Hold on. I know y'all like, I always got to bend over. I don't have it close because I want to. Oh, and I changed my colors, y'all. I had pink. I didn't change these like 15 times. But I had pink because I was trying to bring out the pink. But then I did the pink on the pillows. I didn't like it. So I put the orange up here. The orange is working. So see. The orange. The orange is working. With the little pink over there. It's, don't look at my mess. But the orange is working. So yeah, we like our orange. So then I got. What else I get? Um, oh, and I found these. Oh my God, you guys. These are so... So, 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 so cute. So, I know Christmas is far away. It's not that far, but far enough. But y'all know how hard it is, depending on where you live at, to find black figurines. So, look what I found yesterday. Ain't they so cute? Oh! They are so adorable, and this was $16.99. Move my little hand if I don't put my glove on. But how cute, and the little snow falling off. See, we don't do glitter very well. But anyway, but what I'm going I am going to do because their hair is like totally, totally white. I don't like that. So I'm gonna get a dry brush, and some chalk paint, and just kinda, you know, give them a little grayish look. Y'all know, not completely white. But anyway, so I found that for my Christmas decor. So along with that, I found at Burlington. And then him is so cute. Look at him in, in his jammers, y'all. Look, look at him. Look at him in his jammers. How cute is that? I was like, you know what? He was too cute in his pajamas, so I had to get it. And it was 10. Whew. Nine, 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 nine. See, and I don't know if you could tell if I get up close. Y'all can see he got a little gray in him. It ain't completely white. It was a little more realistic. It's like blue or something. But anyway, so I'm going to put that on them. But I thought, and look at the little, look at the little slippers, y'all. So, yeah, I think my theme this year, <clears throat> I was going to change. I wanted to do, like, Candy Lantern. Ooh, girl. Oh, I still might do Candy Lantern. I've been finding big candy things and wondering what I could do with them. Like, ooh, I could have, I might do Candy Lantern in my living room, y'all. Okay. Anywho, I don't care if y'all copy, because I was going to look the same. So, anyway, I don't know. I'm getting off subject now. Anywho, uh, yeah, so I found that. And then I found, the last thing I found at Marshall's was this comforter, throw, whatever. And I found it because it matches my room once again. I know, and it's not going at the bottom of my bed, though. I got this for the dog bed. Yeah. So what I did with her bed, y'all, was I, um, I'm sorry, I'm looking at her TJ Maxx. Her TJ Maxx is cuter than my TJ Maxx. That's okay. I'm going to Home Goods. So anyway, though, um, I I've seen. I think I showed y'all already. Yeah, I showed y'all. Like I'm trying to get my my room together, and I found one of these to go at the bottom of my bed that matches my pillows. And then there's a look a little throw on the corner. Well, this matches that little throw on the corner, which means that it's going on the doggy bed, so she can match. Cause I don't like her blankets that are in my room right now. They all kind of colorful, and it just don't look good to me. So I'm trying to make the doggy bed a little more cute. So what I will be doing is Tuesday. Today is Wednesday. She don't get it until Friday because that's when she goes in for her bath. And then I'll put it on her bed then. Because I also need to get a body pillow to put behind her bed against the wall. I know you guys are like, what for the dog yet? Because the dog's not allowed in my bed. I understand some of y'all let y'all dogs in y'all bed. That's great. That's beautiful. Some of y'all kiss y'all dogs in the mouth. That's great. That's beautiful. Some of y'all let y'all dogs in the kitchen. That's great. That's beautiful. I don't do none. But we still love each other. And we have understanding. <laughs> So anyway, this is going to be her blanket for her bed until it's time to decorate for Christmas. 
and she'll still have this but there'll be something more festive on her bed i know y'all like for the dog yes for the dog so anywho i got this this matches my room matches her bed i mean matches my room and then i was saying what was i saying before the oh on her bed i what i did was for the her bed i went ahead and got um for any of y'all that want to know um i got crib sheets and i use crib sheets on my dog's bed to keep it from so every like week as every other day depending on when she done went outside and what the she done rolled in <laughs> whether or not i gotta give her a good midweek wipe down <laughs> Still wipe her paws and stuff, but if I gotta give her midweek wipe down, because y'all know dogs can go outside and find some stuff and come back stinking, you be like, where the hell you been? So, anyway, that's what happened with that. And so I got this for her bed. And when I change her sheets on Friday, yes, just like I do mine, I change hers on Friday. Um, then she'll get her new blanket. I bet. You know she ain't got like no little big queen tin bed and she really ain't got no it ain't even a uh a toddler you know mattress but i realized that the bigger dog beds you can put crib sheets on and they fit the bed so that's a great way to keep your doggy bed clean all right that's my marshals um am i gonna let this run no, i'm gonna stop and start off Okay, yeah, because that other one was like 11 minutes. I was too long already. So, next we are. I know y'all. I keep saying I'm going to do this wall. I'm going to get this wall done. I know y'all like them little ass mirrors. <laughs> I'm going to get this wall complete. Maybe today. I got to deal with some other stuff. But I might be able to do the map. Because I told you I got this big old map to go across this wall. But back to my haul. My TJ Maxx. Um, why is this so heavy? Got, oh, some TJ Maxx. Whoa, we. Oh, I got some more of those things. That's right, I did get four. So these ones are a little. Oh, I thought they were bigger. They're not. Oh. So I found these ones at T the TJ Maxx, the blue that matches. So I guess I did get four. Oops. I think I got those two because I thought they were smaller than these two, but now that I'm looking, I believe. Yeah, they're the same size. Oh, well. I just have four baking dishes now. And I don't eat big ones because I don't cook a lot for a lot of people. So. Anyway, got two more of those in the blue. I have my little hand. Those are those. So I could throw the aluminums away and use those now. Those are some temporary aluminums anyway. And then I found, I just got a little miscellaneous stuff, y'all, because I was, got some toothbrush covers. I think I'm going to send these to the G-Babies. I think that's why I got them. It was like six bucks. So the toothbrush covers. And some overnight acne dots. I know you could wear the other ones, but these ones, I guess, apparently are overnight. You wear them overnight. After cleansing, apply sticker with sticky side down onto blemish. Don't apply any square for six hours or overnight. So, you know, the other ones is like a couple minutes or whatever. Those are six hours. But, of course, y'all know I'm still working on these lashes. Still working on these lashes. So, I got me some more magnetic lashes. I'm going to put some on today. Oh, these ones have this one has the invisiband versus the actual mag magnets you can see so i didn't i didn't know that but okay so these have no these got the actual magnets okay and this this brand i can't ardell is that how you say it this brand i've done it before and i like the way it they stick so i'm gonna try some of these probably today and I know I still got them self-adhesive ones. Y'all know, when it came to the brows, I finally got them done. I don't want to go get my lashes done. I've been having problems with really dry eye. And I don't know if it's the mascara. I don't, I don't know if it's from having lashes. I don't know. But what I do know is, I do like these. My eyes wasn't getting dry um, when I was wearing these. So we'll see. So anyway, got some of those. And I got this what is this gushu geisha facial to i don't know but it's supposed to it's an ancient facial technique that involves scraping the skin with the facial tool to promote youthful glow and a radiant complexion 
guide the tool gently up and out starting with the neck jawline and chin and around the mouth repeat three to five times per area next sweep across the cheeks and gently glide under eyes across the eyebrows and from the forehead to the hairline repeat three to five times use with recommended using with your favorite facial oil to glide the tool do not use on open wounds or broken skin wash with cold water mild soap ceramic so yeah that's that's that i don't know if it's gonna, we're gonna see we're gonna tighten up this jawline <laughs> oh and then i found a meat masher been looking for one of those meat masher two bucks i see one of these on i don't know somebody somebody's haul i was like they make them what a pancake. What else I get from the TJ Max? From the front of TJ Max. Oh. I got some more essential oils. And this is stress relief, dream sweet, and relax. I'm about to light some put light some of these and put some of these up in the house in a minute. Cause I was making potatoes with garlic and all kind of stuff. And my house smells like garlic now. And what oh, we got a whole bunch of essential oils. And then I got this brand, Rest and Relax. And this is headache. We're going to try that because, boy, these, I have a headache. And I told y'all I didn't turn into migraines. And I'm on this medicine now. I just got to figure it out. Am I too dang it's dark on that side? Oops, shot my bad. Anyway, so I got that kind. And all these were like, oh, this was $7.99. This better be some good oil for some $7.99. And then I got this brand, the Eucalyptus Mint and Lavender. Because those three smell really good together. And then, golly, I'm running out of space, y'all. Right? Put these over here. Okay. And then I got, what else I got? I got this heat wrap for my bag. Matter of fact, I'm about to get ready to use this because my goddamn bag is hurting. This is reduces swelling. I don't know, but you could use it hot or cold. Oh, yeah. And I paid five bucks for this. I'm about to, um, uh, Put this in the microwave for my little 30 seconds and yeah, put this on my back because yeah, my back is hurting this morning. Oh, and this was the thing that uh, essential oil diffuser I got from my friend. I'm gonna tell y'all he his asthma. So we're gonna see if I can help him with his asthma. So that with this and have him use the breathe deep. Because I think the breathe deep that comes with uh, yeah, the eucalyptus, mint, basil, pine, frankincense, and lavender. It's the eucalyptus and the mint that helps you breathe, though. So, I'll be giving that to him. And this one was 10 bucks. Diffuser. It's 10 dollars 11 bucks, really. Ten ninety nine. dollars Who the little hand. And last but not least, from the TJ Maxx, I got some soap. I just need... I got all kind of soaps. I mean, antibacterial stuff that I'm getting rid of and getting rid of and getting rid of, y'all. And so, I'm trying to find some real soap because I use... um. Oh, rain fart. The soap that they tell you to wash with before you get surgeries and stuff at the hospital, I got the big gallon of that. And so, um, HIPAA cleanse. Ha <laughs> ha! And so I add that to everything now instead of trying to buy antibacterial everything. I was trying to find an easier way to hope buy a whole bunch of antibacterial soap. So I just buy soap and pour some HIPAA cleanse in there. Oh, wait a minute, where'd she get this little cute thing in dustpan? It's a broom and dustpan and it, and it, and it, and let me let y'all go. She got this, I'm like, where she, did she do? She and Timmy women, y'all, I'm missing it. Okay, I gotta let y'all go. Anyway, I got this good little soap. And it's a, <coughs> <coughs> oh, it smells good. It smells like, <coughs> smell like dish soap. <coughs> but anywho. Um, so yeah, I just gonna be pouring regular soap in with the HEPA cleanse to for disinfecting. I mean, and a you know, antibacterial soap. So anyway, yeah, that's my little piece of haul for the morning. That is the morning piece of haul. Mm -mm, mm -mm, the morning piece of haul. The Marshalls and the TJ Maxx. <laughs> All right, y'all. See y'all soon.